we're going to pretend that you're all firefighters. It's a pretty cool job. You get to go around and put out fires and help people, and then you get paid for it. So we are going to pay you because you're firefighters who do a good job of saving people. I think that's Jaden. Oh my god. This is for you. <laughs> Aubrey. Thank you. <gasps> How rude. Nice job. Oh, oh this is not fair, sir. <laughs> what do you mean? It's not fair. What? Because I wait. We could have a cupcake. They get a whole cupcake. We need a full cupcake. What? Yeah. A full cupcake. cupcake too. That's not fair. You're not getting us enough. Nicholas, do you think it's fair that you get a full cupcake and Aubrey only gets half? Not really. I mean, that's what it was like in the old days, though. So. <laughs> I mean, do you, think, do you think you should all get whole cupcakes? Yeah! Just because you're a You don't get to, to, to get to decide we get half a cupcake. Have you ever heard of C-DAW? C-E-D-A-W. Do you know what C-DAW is? C-DAW? I have no idea what C-DAW is. C-E-D-A-W? No, I don't. No. No? Have you ever heard of C-DAW? No. What is C-DAW? CEDAW stands for Convention on the Elimination of All Forms of Discrimination Against Women. CEDAW is an ordinance that requires governments to evaluate their programs and budgets to make sure they are affecting men and women equally. It's a process by which governments can evaluate themselves and make way for greater equity. If no discrimination is found, then that is great! But if it is found, the governments have the tools they need to handle it efficiently. Over 200 organizations worldwide have endorsed CEDAW. Here are just some of the many organizations that have become part of this movement. As you can see, many countries worldwide have already taken this initiative and passed it or have even considered this resolution. Many countries are fully engaged in the CEDAW resolution, meaning that they are signed and enforced within its borders. Others are currently processing this resolution and will hopefully fully pass it soon. There are six UN countries that have not ratified CEDAW, and the US is one of them. Though signed by President Jimmy Carter in 1980, the treaty has never been passed by the US Senate and thus has no force in the USA. So what is the initiative in Sarasota? The United States as a whole is one of only six UN nations that have not passed CETA. Instead, individual cities across the US have decided to implement their own versions. We would like to see the city of Sarasota pass a version of CETA to join other cities and nations that have agreed to look into and address gender discrepancies. Why should the city of Sarasota pass this initiative? Many cities across the U.S. have begun to pass their own versions of CEDAW. In the state of Florida, Miami-Dade and Tampa St. Pete have all passed their own resolutions. We all know we are a progressive city that is overall doing very well with gender equality. Yet discrimination against women is often hidden and pervasive. Having our own government take a proactive look at our policies and see if they are helping the sexes equally would benefit all residents of Sarasota, men, women, and children alike. Now that you know a little bit about it, uh, how would you feel about Sarasota passing this? It'd be fine. Good. Yeah. Good idea? <laughs> Good idea. Great idea. Awesome. Fantastic idea. <laughs> what do you think of Sarasota becoming a city for CEDAW? I think it's a great idea. I don't know why the United States doesn't already participate. So, go for it. Yeah. Sounds like a good idea. Why not? Why not? It sounds like it from your description, and I think it would be a great thing for gender um, equality. And, um, yeah, so would you be in favor of Sarasota embracing this? I sure would, sure. Sure would. So what do we need from you? We are only looking for your support, and that's not a code for monetary donations. We would like to show the Sarasota City Commission that our community supports this initiative. That comes from the support of our local organizations and businesses, and that means people like you. Girls are the same thing, only they have longer hair. <laughs>